Hi, this is Shweb, and most welcome to my third tutorial, which is based on PN junction diode, means silicon diode. Today, I am gonna tell you how PN junction diode works. See, it is PN junction diode, means signal diode. As we all study in engineering first year, like PN junction diode works in forward bias mode means uh, what do you mean by forward bias mode means when positive is connected to the positive end of diode and negative is connected to the negative end of diode this combination is called forward bias so as we study in engineering like pn junction diode works in forward bias when it is connected with forward bias then conduction is start so let us prove this statement true by doing practical today i am going to tell you practically how this statement works means how diode works in forward bias mode as you will see there uh, my 9 volt adapter is connected with breadboard via 7805 IC why I use this IC because I need 5 volt supply not 9 volt that's why I converted this 9 volt supply into 5 volt DC supply 9 volt DC converted into 5 volt via 7805 how it is used it is very simple just connect positive end of with first leg middle end with negative and at a last end you will get output means input is 9 volt and you will get 5 volt output 9 volt DC converted into 5 volt DC so that's how 7805 works. Now let's start the practical. As you all see I have one LED, one buzzer, one PN junction diode and resistance. Like I connected this wire with positive means output leg of 7805 which have 5 volt DC. Now next step I connect positive end of diode with positive 5 volt supply and negative end is free as I told in one of the video like black one is positive and silver one is negative so black is connected with positive and silver is connected with negative as free now third step next I connected this buzzer with diode and add one LED also for light indication And finally in the end in order to make circuit complete I connect this last end with ground means negative now as we see the positive end of diode is connected with positive and negative end of diode is connected with negative side means which ground with one buzzer and LED now see what happens when I turn on the adapter see the LED start glow and buzzer start sound because the circuit is complete diode is connected in forward bias mode means how this will done because at the positive side of diode there was a holes and negative side of diodes there was electron holes are positive in nature and electrons are negative in nature what happened when positive is connected with positive means positive plus positive cause repulsion and negative is connected with negative negative plus negative means also rep repulsion so what happened from that side black hand holes are rippled toward depletion layer and what happened at this site electrons are also rippled toward depletion layer and then electrons are jumped toward positive portion and holes are jumped toward negative portion in that way conduction start that's why diode work in positive means forward bias mode let us try to put this diode in reverse bias it is working forward bias let us try to put this diode in reverse bias mode and see what happens 
सी आई कनेक्ट दिस डायोड इन रिवर्स बाय अस मोड मींस नेगेटिव इज कनेक्ट विद पॉजिटिव एंड पॉजिटिव इज कनेक्ट विद नेगेटिव लेट अस सी आई टर्न ऑन द सॉकेट सप्लाई इज टर्न ऑन सी इट इज नॉट वर्किंग बिकॉज इट इज कनेक्ट इन रिवर्स बाय अस एंड पी एन जंक्शन डायोड इज नॉट वर्क इन रिवर्स बाय अस मोड बिकॉज नेगेटिव हैव इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इन पॉजिटिव एंड हैव holes non negative is connected with positive means attraction and holes is connected with negative means attraction both the side attraction happen which causes depletion layer more wide and it will stop conduction that's why diode is not work in reverse bias mode let us again put this diode in forward bias now again i put this diode in forward bias means positive is connect with positive end of supply and negative is connect with negative Let us see what happened when I turn on the circuit. It start working because of forward bias combination. So, friend, I hope this tutorials proved helpful for you all. Thanks for watching my video. For my more tutorials, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Please subscribe my channel. I will be back again very soon with more interesting tutorials. Thanks for watching my video. and please subscribe my channel for more update thank you